Okay, and welcome to our tour of City of Heroes, or in this case, I should say, City of Villains. We are on the original villain tutorial known as Breakout. It was retired in issue 21 and replaced with a hero-villain co-op tutorial that we'll visit on another video tour. But since this was an old character that I created but never started, it was still in Breakout, so we get to run it and show you what it was like. The only other way to get to this map at all is through the Ouroboros flashback system, and if you're a badge collector, you're going to want to do that because there's a hidden badge on this map, and we're going to show it to you. As you can see, we have the map open. So you can see, you've seen what the map's all about. Let's start our contact here. Okay, we have to get something for him from the hospital area. And we get instructions here on how to use the map. Okay, let's ask about the contact to see his history. Okay. Now we're going to go get the secret badge. It is only available in this map. Now, there is a mid-level villain side mission that will put you back into this map, or at least what looks like it, but the badge won't be in it. The only way to get this with this tutorial retired now is through the Ouroboros flashback system. There is no other way to do it. So we walk into cell number 15 here, and we get the map badge. It's called Jailbird. Hmm. We actually have villains running around already trying to shoot me. Hmm. Well, it's a little early for villain combat yet, so we're just going to ignore them. Though I suspect they're going to chase me a bit. Okay, we'll just go ahead and talk to this nurse. Okay. And we get what our contact needs. And we get a new contact. It doesn't matter which one we pick, so we'll take that one. There he is. This was the other contact, but he won't be speaking to us. And there's a security guard having a very bad day. Okay, so we found what we needed, as well as what he needed. Now we learn about the difficulty of villain levels compared to our own. That other cop looks like they're going to have a bad day pretty soon. The whole purpose of this is, aside from teaching you the game, the plot is that Arachnos has staged a breakout. They're looking for villains that are considered to be destined ones to join Arachnos and prove themselves to Recluse, the leader of Arachnos. And there's another guard having a very miserable day.
Okay, so we gotta go beat up two of the fellow escapees. That's no problem. Or we could take out two guards if there are any guards nearby. Okay, so that's the two. And the others chase me will be shot down by these arachnos. Okay, so now we get inspirations. Which we really don't need to use, but hey, what the heck, they're nice to have for this. And we gotta go beat up two more. Sprint so we can move a little bit faster now. Okay, let's go find the pilot and see about getting an airlift out of here. For the most part, these goons will ignore us. Although some appear to be being stubborn about that, but that's okay. And here's our pilot. And he has a mission. So we gotta go rescue his co-pilot named Jenkins, who's basically a bit of an incompetent maroon. And I have a hunch his name was very much inspired by Leroy Jenkins of World of Warcraft fame. For those of you that don't understand that reference, do a YouTube search or a Google search, Leroy Jenkins, you'll find it. As you can see, Jenkins spilled my name to the longbow. <laughs> that doesn't matter. Longbow is not going to benefit from that knowledge. Okay, now we get Jenkins to come with us. We're going to take out a few guards and set up bomb. humming sound you're hearing is our glowing object. All the glowies make a hum that helps you to find them. Oops. Moved a little too much. Let's try that again. Never move or get attacked when you're hitting a glowy. 
Okay, mission accomplished. Jenkins is saved, and I am now level two. Oh, joy. Let's just go ahead and try on up out of here. So mission accomplished, and I can now choose my startup contact, Kalinda or Burke. If you choose Burke, you're not as quite as loyal to Arachnos as Arachnos would like. If you choose Kalinda, then hey, you're loyal to Arachnos. So I'm just going to go with tradition and take Kalinda. And here we are. We leave the tutorial, and we now arrive at the new startup point on Mercy Island. When the tur when the tutorial got changed, so did the startup point. But that's okay. Okay, and that is a cut, a print, and a wrap for this tutorial of City of Heroes, City of Villains. Hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you in our next video.